Shut, shut the door, good John, fatigued, I said, tie up the knocker, say I'm sick, I'm dead. The door, star, ages, nay, it is past a doubt, O oh, Bedlam, or oh, Parnassus is let out, fire in each eye, and papers in each hand. They rave, eh, recite, and madden round the land. What woes can guard me, or what shades can hide? They pierce my thickets, through my grot they glide. By land, by water, they renew the charge, they stop the chariot, and they board the barge. No place is sacred, not the church is free. Even Sunday shines no Sabbath day for me. Then from the mint walks forth the man of rhyme, happy to catch me just at dinner time. Is there a parson much bemused in beer, a maudlin poetess, a rhyming peer, a clerk foredoomed his father's soul to cross, who pens a stanza when he should engross? Is there who, locked from ink and paper scrolls, with desperate charcoal round his darkened walls? Oh, fly to Twitnam, and in a humble strain, apply to me to keep them mad or vain. Arthur, whose giddy son neglects the laws, imputes to me and my damned works the cause. Poor Cornus sees his frantic wife elope, and curses wit and poetry and pope. Friend to my life, which did not you prolong. The world had wanted many an idle song. What drop or nostrum can this plague remove, or which must end me a fool's wrath or love? A dire dilemma either way I'm sped. If foes they write, if friends they read me dead, seized and tied down to judge how wretched I who can't be silent, and who will not lie. To laugh were want of goodness and of grace, and to be grave exceeds all power of face. I sit with sad civility, I read with honest anguish, and an aching head, and drop at last, but in unwilling ears, this saving counsel keep your peace nine years.